Hello everyone, my name is Charlotte and I'm an international student from China and in today's video, I want to show you guys something about Chinese calligraphy Calligraphy is an artistic expression of the beauty of writing that is unique to China and the surrounding cultures and regions that have been influenced by Chinese culture In the broad sense, calligraphy was refers to the rules of writing of written symbols. In other words, calligraphy refers to the art of writing in accordance with the characteristics of words and their meanings, with their calligraphic strokes, structures, and chapters, making them aesthetically pleasing works of art. And today, I would like to introduce to you five Chinese calligraphy fonts. The first one is Seal Script, which is the collective name of big cell script and little cell script. The oracle bound script, which is 3,000 years old, is the earliest legible script and is mainly used for definition. It has a lean and straight style of writing with more straight lines. There are square and round strokes as well as pointed strokes. And there are many hanging stitches in the handwriting. The big seal refers to the Jing, Zhou, and Six Kingdom scripts, which preserve the characteristics of ancient pictographs. The small seal script, also known as Qing seal script, was the common script of the Qing dynasty. It is a simplified version of the big seal script, which is characterized by its uniform shape and easier to write than the prehand script. Next is the Li script, also known as Han Li which is a dignified script in Chinese characters. It is written in a slightly wide and flat shape, with long horizontal and short straight joints, and is rectangular in shape. The script originated in the Qing Dynasty and was compiled by Chen Miao. It reached its peak in the Eastern Han Dynasty and has a significant impact on letter calligraphy. The regular script is known as Zheng Shu. It evolved from Chen Miao's clerical script, which was more simplified and straight and horizontal. It was only in the uh, northern Song Dynasty and that it uh, replaced the name Zheng Shu and its content was obviously different from the ancient name. Nowadays, Chinese standard fonts are all of this kind, and it is usually recommended to use this kind of font for the Chinese college entrance exams because it is more clear and recognizable before and highly legible. The cursive script is a type of Chinese character characterized by its simple structure and continuously strokes. It was formed in the Han Dynasty and evolved from the clerical script for the sake of writing simplicity. There are chapter cursive, modern cursive, and wild cursive, which is before in uh, the midst of chaos. This font was very difficult with recognition, I have to say, for the Chinese as well. And this is the font between regular script and cursive script and was created to make up for the slow writing speed of regular script and the difficulty of recognizing cursive script. The word Xing means to walk, so it is not as sloppy as the cursive script or is it as straight as the regular script. Those with more regular style than cursive style are called Xing Kai, while those with more cursive style than regular style are called Xing Cao. Next, I show you guys the calligraphy I wrote. This is the font that belongs to cursive script, and the next one belongs to the Xing Kai, which is means resignation of the old and welcome to new. And that's all about today's sharing. Hope you guys enjoy it.